Hi guys, let's talk about how we can increase impression on Twitter. We all know what an increased impression means today on Twitter. Before we get started, I would like to differentiate between reach and impression on Twitter. A lot of people misuse these two words. It is very important. We clear this before we get started. Now, reach is the number of people that saw a tweet on the platform. The number of people that saw a particular tweet on Twitter. Now, the impression is the number of times people saw this tweet on Twitter. What this means is that one person will see a tweet in the morning. This tweet has one reach. If this same person sees this tweet in the afternoon, it is now one reach and two impressions. If this same person sees this tweet in the evening, this tweet has one reach still and three impressions. It is that simple. The number of people that sees a tweet is the tweet's reach. Why the number of times people see this tweet is the tweet's impression. I'll be showing you how you can see a tweet impression on the screen now. You can see this even if you are using the Twitter app. You can see it from your analytics. This is your impression. Now, you know the difference between tweet reach and tweet impression. I highlighted five ways we can increase impressions on Twitter. You may find out at the end of this video that there are more than five ways you can do this. I will try as much as possible to use a layman's language so that whoever you are watching this video, you'll be able to flow. Stick to the end. I'll be reserving the best or the most important for the last. If you are a returning subscriber, keep being amazing. If you are new here, you are welcome. Let's get started. The first way you can build your impressions on Twitter is through engagement. Engagement on your own tweets and engagement on other people's tweets. These people can be your followers, they can be influencers, they can be brands, they can even be followers who follow your followers. Okay, I will try to explain. On your own tweets, when people comment, when people like, when people retweet, always acknowledge them. You can just make a tweet to acknowledge these people. This way, they will know you are seeing them. This way, they will know you are appreciating what they are doing. Secondly, on your own tweet, when someone comments, try to answer. Still, on your own tweets, when they comment on your tweet, always respond. Especially if you are selling anything. When they ask a question, be there to respond. If they are asking you a question about your product, if they are appreciating you, if they are leaving a nice comment, always respond in this way they will know that you are listening they will know your brand or your handle has a human face this way too you'll be building relationship from the question they ask and your response someone might retweet your response and from there you'll be getting more impression the person that commented on your post will also get impression now I'm talking about engagement on other people's tweets this could be your followers followers who follow your followers influencers or brands when you comment on their tweets you are getting impression when someone reposts your comment on their tweet your brand will be in the faces of people who don't even know you you'll be getting more awareness and you will be increasing your impression as well so do well to engage on other people's tweets next is to engage with influencers you can use clear which is a twitter analytic tool to find out the most influential accounts on Twitter. This tool is free. You can also follow brands. Most of these brands have large followers. Always engage with their tweets. You can like, you can comment, you can repost. You'll be increasing awareness for your brand and you will also be increasing impression. When you comment on their post, you are getting impression. People are getting to know your brand and this is a good one. Always engage on your tweets and other people's tweets. This way you will be building impressions, you will be creating awareness for your brands and you will be creating relationship. The next one is about your tweets. Your tweets should be creative. Your tweets should be able to attract people and entice them. You can do this by creating rich content. You can use media tools like pictures, 
graphics. You can even use memes. You can use links. When you get to your Twitter analytics dashboard, you will get to see that tweets with pictures get more attention. So when next you are making your tweet, make sure this tweet is attractive. This tweet is creative. Next way you can increase impression is to be consistent, be frequent. Don't just go away from the faces of your target audience. Always be there. They are following you because you are dishing out content. Don't starve them of your content, okay? Always be consistent. To do this, you will have to find out who your target audience are. What is their main interest? What kind of tweets attract their attention? You can find this on your Twitter analytics dashboard. Find out who your target audience are. What is their main interest? What kind of tweets attract their attention? Once you find out all of this, be consistent. They are following you for content. Give them content. Don't go away from their faces. Always put your brand or your handle in their faces. Let them know that you are still around. Don't allow them to start looking for you. It is not a good one. Be consistent. Be frequent with your tweets this way you will be getting more impressions there is this particular handle i follow this handle posts gain tweets every 40 minutes past every hour so i've already known that she posts this tweet and i will always wait for her this is consistency by the time she drops a particular tweet within two minutes we have more than 100 comments people are reposting people are liking this is because she is consistent. She is frequent. So to increase your impressions, always be consistent and frequent. Don't go away from the faces of your target audience. They want to see what you have to offer. Give them content. I've talked about engagement. Engage people both on your tweets and on their tweets. These people can be your followers, brands, or influencers. Engage them. You will be getting impressions. Next is the type of tweets you make. Make it rich. Make it creative. This way people will be hungry to see your tweets. People will be hungry to see what you have to offer. They will be able to engage. The more they are engaging, they are reposting, they are commenting, they are getting impressions. You yourself, you are getting impressions as well. The next one I've talked about is to be consistent. Be frequent. Once you know what your target audience wants, give them. Don't allow them to be hungry for your content. Always give them what they signed up for. The fourth way you can increase your impression on Twitter is through hashtags. Hashtags are a very big way you can increase your impression on Twitter. To do this, make sure these hashtags are trending, they are relevant to you, and they are efficient. You can find these hashtags free on Twitter app. I'll be illustrating how you can do this on the screen. Check for what is trending at the moment. Make sure this is relevant to your content and use them in your tweets. You can also use other third-party analytics tools. I'll be listing some of them on the screen as well. Some of these tools are not free, while some are free. If you cannot afford any of these tools, you can use the free one on Twitter. Check for what is trending and use these trends. Make sure they are relevant to you and they are efficient. This way, when people log into their Twitter accounts, they are searching for a specific hashtag that is trending. They can always see your tweets and start engaging with your tweets. An example is when someone checks and see that Elon is trending. They would like to know why Elon is trending. They will simply tap on Elon and every tweet that has Elon at that particular time will be shown. If your tweet is creative, if they like what they see, if your tweet entices them, they will like to comment. They will even repost or follow you. This way, you will increase your impression. So always use hashtags. You can use so many third-party tools for this. Some of them are free, some of them are not. But on the Twitter app, you will find it free to use. So always use hashtags that are trending and relevant to you. This way, when people search for what is trending, your tweet will be on their faces. These hashtags can introduce you to an entirely new audience. This new audience will start following you commenting, reposting, and liking your tweets. This way, your tweets will get to more people. This will mean more impressions for you. Just because you used a trending hashtag that is relevant to you. So guys, so far, we've listed four ways you can do this. I know you've counted more than four, 
but it's okay. We've talked about engagement both on your tweets and other people's tweets. We've talked about making your content rich and creative. If you're a blogger, make sure you use images on your blog post so that when you post the link on Twitter, it will help to entice people. We've talked about being consistent and frequent. We've talked about using hashtags. These are the four we have mentioned. So guys, if you are enjoying this video, please like, give this video a thumbs up, share with your friends and follow us so that they too will benefit on how they can increase their impressions on Twitter. If you have not subscribed, please subscribe and turn on notifications to join us. If you are watching this video from Twitter, please let me know in the comment section below. Simply type your Twitter bro or your Twitter sis. I will acknowledge that. So, to the last one now, I reserved this. The last way to increase your impressions on Twitter is to schedule your tweets. Whether we believe it or not, a lot of information and data are available online. When you are posting or tweeting, tens if not hundreds of people are posting and tweeting at the same time. So how do you stand out? How do you get your tweets in the faces of people? This is where scheduling your post comes in. Always schedule when your followers are online. This is the optimal time to post when your followers are most active online. This way you will put your tweet in their faces because they are the ones that will help you to retweet or repost to get to more people. You can use a tool for this. You can also find this on the Twitter analytics dashboard. Find out when your followers are online. This is when you are to post. Okay? Once you do this, you will be able to get more impressions because when people retweet it gets to more people it will help to increase your impression always post when your followers are most active online this is the right time to post to get more impressions and to get to more people thanks for watching till this point to increase your impressions on twitter engage both on your tweets and other people's tweets this will help to increase your impressions make sure you post rich and creative content to entice people you have to be consistent and frequent always use relevant and trending hashtag and finally schedule your tweets the optimal time when your most active followers are online is the best time to tweet thanks for watching guys i do hope this video helped you so i ask you which of these have you been implementing which of these have been working for you? Which of these have you been using and are not working for you? Any challenges? Would you like to share? Let me know in the comment section below. Do you have other ways you can increase your impressions on Twitter that are not listed in this video? Would you like to share? Let's meet you in the comment section below. As we all strive to increase our impressions on Twitter, I pray that we all win. Thanks for watching guys. I will see you in my next one. Please like, share, subscribe and turn on notifications. Bye-bye.